Is I'm that? gonna definitely take this on the track, so you all sh should come <laughs> see it on the track. Oh, I would break. love to. Hey guys, Kim here with Like Tesla. So behind me is not just any Model 3, it is the second performance Model 3 here in the state of Georgia. So today we're gonna take it for a spin, compare it to our Model 3. You know, I've driven you know, Ferrari and a Lambo and a um, GTR. You're gonna have so much fun. How <laughs> did it compare then to the other cars? It's in a totally different class because it handles like a 911, but it's as fast as get out. Like it's, they clocked it at like 3.3, I think. One, two, three. What? Oh, <laughs> oh man. I've actually had that problem with this car. It's the biggest problem with yeah. the car is it is so fast that you want to drive it fast and you take a couple people around a few times and you're just nauseous because it's like it you've been really, on a roller coaster. We debated between our silver and red and he wanted to like change it last minute but then we kind of like had fallen in love with that. You know, silver, I, I, I do, I, I really am a fan of the silver. I'm a big fan of the white also. I'm getting a white. This is what I'm getting you should with my absolutely. Model This is ceramic. This is not plastic. So it is cool. You can tell, like, it's actually nicer than what I expected when I saw the picture. I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm gonna like white being there, but it actually is pretty nice. Were you upset about not having Alcantara? Yeah, I have it on the X, the black Alcantara. Yeah. I, I, I think it would look better if it did have all black on yeah. the headliner, all black Alcantara, but it's fine. Huh. There goes Apollo 3. Apollo. Don't get jealous, Apollo. What did you name, <laughs> what is the name of this beauty? Flash. Oh. <laughs> So one of the things we were talking about on the way here was if it actually says like ludicrous mode. It's always in performance mode. Oh. So you, you've always got the power available. Yeah, okay, so that's kind of cool. Here we go. Right here. <laughs> yeah, just See. punch it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that is like unlike anything I've experienced. <laughs> yeah. I feel like it's like Silicon Valley where they have like their mouth flying backwards on them. Officer, hi. Is there anything I can do to make this all go away? That is nuts. Wow, it feels like a roller coaster. Really is that just like boom. It's funny because before Tesla, I was not really a car person. But this car has changed me. Like, I hadn't really experienced how fun a car, oh, a good, fast car could be. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you, like, have to scream. I can't help it. <laughs> it's, like, a huge difference between this and what we have. It handles completely different. Well, Apollo it's 3 like... is, like, old news now. Like, maybe we should think about trading. And there's some cops right here. Yeah, probably not a best, the best. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're not doing anything. Just going for a little drive. <laughs> the red car. I know is the a red car with the red brake calipers. You're already asking for it. How did you get the second Performance Model 3? Like, what's the story behind that? So, I always wanted a Tesla, and I stood in line on the very first day on the 31st in 2016, actually, that's a long time ago. And uh, I put my name down, put the money down, it's great, got the little thing from Elon, thanks for ordering. And then in, I think October of the same year, they called me up and they're like, hey, you know, your test drive is scheduled for your Model X, come check it out, and I just fell in love with it. So we ended up getting the Model X, put my family in this, and when my reservation came up, uh, they let me configure in May. It's been great, so you've driven it now. Yes, I think as we've said before, this is, might be like one of the most expensive test drives I have ever been on because I think I need performance. Wow. I don't know if you guys have seen it, the picture of like a hundred red ones that they're sending out to all the delivery centers and whatnot for it test drives. It looks good in red. Yeah, I mean, Every car has its color. Yeah, it really does. I think the X is white and the three is red. I don't know what the, the S 
propeller is, but the S, yeah. So we've got the 20 inch wheels, the Brembo brakes. So they're not just bigger brakes, but they can you know handle better on the track. So we actually do need to take this out on the track. I'm waiting for the track mode. It is configurable apparently. So yeah. when we do get it out, we'll be able to tweak some things. Um, apparently at your own risk, which is yes. frightening. Are you worried about I'm, that? I'm a little like, bit, when I read that part, I'm like, I don't like, I don't want to break my car, but that's okay. Yeah, but they'll the, do it on your birthday every year. Yeah, right? the, uh, exactly. And it's got the <laughs> uh, Michelin Pilot uh, Sport 4S's on here. So it really grips and handles the road yeah. uh, real well. I think for me, the 20 inch wheels and the, the big tires make a big difference. Right, and it's a little bit lower, right? Yeah, it's a little bit low, about 10 centimeters lower than a standard. Uh, I actually love these handles, by the do way. You? So yeah. do you? Do you grab over or under? So I always go like this. Okay. Over, I suppose. It's definitely interesting comparing the Tesla White Seas to our T Sport line, but it feels a little bit different. They're both. I mean, I don't really feel like I can say one is better than the other at this point. I guess it will depend in the long run, but they they both look gorgeous. They feel different. This feels more leather-ish, I think, to me. Yeah. Um, where ours, the T-Sport lines, are a little more um, like a rubbery type feel maybe to it. So it'll be interesting to see how they fold up. This. So you already ordered it? I already ordered it, yeah. Yeah, so this has the regular it. wheels, but it has the perforated. This is when it had the um, performance upgrade package included the cool yeah. seats. Does they all, do all of them have the black? No, no, they don't do this anymore. I don't know why they get rid of things. Do you love me? <laughs> Sorry. I kind of had to get that in, right? I'm going to definitely take this on the track, so you all sh should come see it on the track. Oh, I would I, love to. Like, I want to wait till they enable that and everything. I'm guessing I'll have to get a new pair of tires are you afterwards. Worried? Yeah, are you worried about, like, what it will do to the car? I don't, I don't care. It's fine. It's just a car. Like, I've, I've actually started, like, was like, really worried when I'm washing like yeah. other swirls in it like you yeah. know what I'm just gonna be okay it's gonna yeah. be all right yeah. folks they, they always ask me they're like oh do you ever it's like I don't need to look at the speed limit it just bings at me whenever yeah. it's going too fast yeah so the the rumors of like the 15 minute delivery are right. absolutely true uh because they were kind of like hey actually we're doing another one right now so yeah. you know you don't have to leave but but it's a different experience. Feel any way, don't go Sorry. Not, not the it's so tempting! <laughs> not at the intersection. I just want to like go play somewhere now. <laughs> Let's go to the track. <laughs> I love not having the, the instrument cluster. Did it take a second for you? It, like, did, it to took get like used? a few days, but I yeah. actually, the fact that that screen is so much closer yeah. to your hand, I like this setup better than the X, and I see why they're yeah. going to redo the X and the S. But the red on white really still does it. Yeah. For a fast car like this, you need red. Definitely. It definitely makes it go a little faster. I'm sure, I think the one that they clocked on YouTube was like 3.3. I'm sure this will go a little faster. That was a black car. So <laughs> yeah, definitely. This is like 3.1. <laughs> For me, the coolest thing was getting rid of my gas car. Actually, the same day I took delivery, we took the Pacific to, to CarMax and it's, it was gone. Like, yeah. great, I'm never gonna go to gas station again. It's the best. Yeah. It's like so cool. And I think that like our kids like won't even, we'll grow up in this world not even knowing gas stations. 